explanation for these bizarro backpacks. And you're carrying you a backpack. We have one here. This is a white color nylon backpack. Like, like, like number two hat. Yeah. And then it's easy enough for you to go ahead and take out uh, the actual device that may house the weapon. There's one theory. Doubt of the official story could easily have been squashed by releasing footage of the bomb being placed. Footage that even Governor Deval Patrick hasn't seen. Well, the, the videotape uh, is not something I've seen. It's been described to me. Uh, but it does uh, seem to, uh, to be pretty clear that, um, that uh, uh, this suspect took the backpack uh, off, put it down. All right, folks, that's part one, and, and there's two other big parts. But the reason the Russians, quote, warned the FBI, the Russians actually said, is this guy your agent? He's got a fake passport. A fake name. Why are you letting him come in and out of your country? Is he an Al-Qaeda operative for you? That's how you blow someone's cover instead of just killing them. The Russians have had a very hands-off uh, stance towards uh, these double and triple agents. And again, I'm not romanticizing the Russians. In the old days, though, the KGB would just kill somebody like that. Instead, I believe they were part of the drill. That's why they, the, you know, the day it happened, they were out partying, didn't care. Then heard on the news, they were the guys that did it, reportedly sort of calling the FBI saying, well, what are you doing? I mean, this all came out, but really wasn't headline news. So they're calling the government and others going, we didn't do this. What in the world are you talking about? That's why I want to tell folks, don't go be part of drills if you're a police officer or even in the FBI, because let me tell you something, the next wave, they're going to try to now say the cops can't be trusted so they can purge police. And if you're a libertarian or conservative cop or constitutionalist cop or something, and they try to get you to be part of drills like this, you're crazy. They'll go, look at Sergeant Ben Johnson, you know, hypothetical name, John Doe. Why, he visited this website and he was part of a shooting club and he was a libertarian tea partier and uh, he blew up the daycare center. I mean, you can script this stuff up one side and down the other. There was a drill. It turns out they're connected to the government. The FBI lies and says, we've never heard of them, been, quote, tracking them for three years. I looked at these brothers. I've talked to their family, who's been willing to come on, hangs the phone up, calls back crying 30 minutes later saying, I was just threatened. I love my daughter. No, no, no. They told me they can do whatever they want. No, no, no. I mean, I live in a movie, folks. No, no, they just go, they will get my daughter. They just, oh, this country, I'm Leo. I mean, it's not funny, folks. And see, no one would believe that or know that unless you had enjoyed, and I say that sarcastically, what I've enjoyed. And the government trying to ruin my family and trying to threaten people in my family until they have nothing to do with me. I mean, that's the type of nasty crud that goes on. I mean, I've gone through stuff Jim Garrison didn't go through. And I don't make a big deal out of it. The point is, I know who runs this government. They've got people that listen to your phone and then wait till the day something bad happens in the middle of some family disasters when they call. And they call up and say, mm -hmm. oh, so your mom or dad's in the hospital? Good, I hope they die. And by the way, I saw a little dog on your back porch. I'm going to cut its head off. This is who runs America. And you know what? Getting scared and going, well, I better not say anything. They'll get me. That's how they win. That's how these thugs win. They're illegitimate. They're a fraud. They're a joke. They're a scam. They're dishonorable. Bongino, the former top um, Secret Service agent on the foreign operations of Obama, his family's been threatened, his office has been broken into, his car's been broken into, he's being threatened, he's being harassed, and he's not even giving out any of the secrets of Obama. They just want him to be scared. We ought to get Bongino back on the show. I mean, are we just a total nation of cowards? You know, I was reading over these government documents that got released by the Clinton group. And they're so incredible that I don't know if I can give justice to them, but we're going to go to break and come back and cover them. And then I guess do some overdrive since I'm here saying I'll go to your phone calls because I want to get to everybody like Alvin that's been holding so long. 
but you read this, it's everything we already knew, but it just confirms three years before Matt Drudge changed the world, is how Breitbart says it, and how news will be consumed. President Bill Clinton's White House feared the Internet was allowing average citizens, especially conservatives, to bypass legacy gatekeepers and access information that had previously been denied to them by the mainstream press. I want all my writers to write stories on this in the next week. That's a, I hardly ever tell them what to write about. They just write about whatever they think is interesting. But this is a directive, guys. Let's write about this because this ties into media matters. Uh, this ties into everything. World Net Daily and Breitbart have the best breakdown on it. But they say in here that this allows them to put stories out that then get into local media, that then get into the Washington Post, New York Times, and it goes into saying then they have congressional committees that start investigating their criminal activity. That's it. They want air superiority where no one can question them, where they can, you know, kill whoever they want in Arkansas, cut their arms and legs off, shoot them nine times in the back of the head, and have the local paper announce it was a suicide. How can you save a ton of money and prepare for emergencies? By having your own in-home freeze dryer from Harvest Right. Now you can cut down on wasted food by freeze drying your leftovers. That's right. Create your own long-term food storage by freeze drying your own fruits, meats, vegetables, even complete meals with the Harvest Right in-home freeze dryer. Imagine the savings and the peace of mind. See how the amazing Harvest Right freeze dryer works at HarvestRight.com. Attention all radio listeners. Survival Life is giving away free credit card knives exclusively to our radio listeners here today. Visit MyCreditCardKnife.com to see this covert knife in action and claim yours for free. It's the same knife you've seen in the airline magazines for $29.95, but today it's yours free. Just pay shipping and handling. MyCreditCardKnife.com, MyCreditCardKnife.com. Go now. Great news, pure water lovers. BigBerkeyWaterFilters.com has a special discount offer for all GCN listeners. You can't do better than a Big Berkey for economy. For only 1.7 cents a gallon, a single set of filters can last for 5 to 10 years. There's none better than a Big Berkey for emergency preparedness as a backup water source. And you just can't beat a Big Berkey to remove dangerous chlorine, all types of fluoride, pathogenic bacteria, cysts, parasites, and unhealthy viruses products from municipal water. Berkey water filter systems are even powerful enough to purify stagnant pond water. For the gold standard in water filters, get a Big Berkey at BigBerkeyWaterFilters.com. And all GCN listeners get 5% off all ceramic filter systems. For details, call 1-877-99-BERKEY. That's 877-99-BERKEY. Big Berkey water filters for the love of clean water. Big business has discovered the preparedness market, and that makes it difficult to know where to go and who to trust. MyPatriotSupply.com is owned and operated by patriots just like you. Has the best prices on storable food, non-GMO seeds, water filtration devices, home canning equipment, survival and self-reliance books, and more. MyPatriotSupply.com has old-fashioned values and the absolute best customer service in the industry. Look for the deal of the day, unique affordable survival survival supplies that fit anyone's budget. Get same-day shipping on all orders and free shipping on orders over $49. Call 866-229-0927, 866-229-0927, or visit MyPatriotSupply.com for emergency preparedness, self-reliance, and food independence. Shop with a name you know and a name you can trust. Before it's time to survive, it's time to prepare. MyPatriotSupply.com. You know what I'm going to do? I'm going to shoot a special report for the nightly news tonight, going over this memo, 331 pages, and then I'm going to air it tomorrow. But I'm going to get into it now as well, and then do overdrive to take your phone calls. World Net Daily has great coverage of it and the whole memo. The 28 pages that are heavily sanitized but are bad enough. And then Breitbart's also uh, got it, clintonlibrary.gov. And, and, and this is what they decided to release. I mean, it's got incredibly authoritarian quotes in here. Moreover, 
the internet allows an extraordinary amount of unregulated data and information to be located in one area and available to all the memo states. And it instructs what they call mainstream media with a list of people not to use and to call all alternative media conspiracy theories. And you wonder why. I mean, I wonder why the Austin American statesman would call me when I caught bribery on tape and the and, and the legislature censured the the, Cong the legislator and admitted it was bribery and. The paper calls up and goes, why are you having conspiracy theories about this payment of money? And I said, it's admitted that it was illegal and wrong. And I caught it on video. No, it's a conspiracy theory. And when Nightline comes here, I, I go, no, these world leaders are calling for global government. And the State Department has its global governance division. Here, let me show you. Oh, that's a different world government they're talking about than you. You're a conspiracy theorist. Oh, here I have eco-science about depopulating the world and... Promoting homosexuality to reduce population. No, that's a conspiracy theory as well. And why are you anti-gay? I'm not anti-anybody. They say they do this for depopulation. They say they're putting cancer viruses in the vaccines. They say, but see, it's this reality management. And then I was reading the 28 pages of the 331-page memo. Boy, I love to see that that the Clinton libraries put out, and it's all about how they were going to shut down the new media and how they were going to control it. I mean, this is so authoritarian, and here's the deal. They've released this themselves. They just don't care. But what did Hillary say a year ago? She said they're losing the information war, and they are because we have the moral high ground, folks. The military is training to take on the American people. That is treason. The military doesn't want to be part of it. If we give them moral support, they won't be part of it. Even when the Clintons pull Oklahoma City part two. And look, I'm willing to risk my life to just put it all on the table here. And the good news is I was the first person to talk about false flag terror on a, on a large platform. I was the first person to, to cover all these issues and then to make it safe for the other alternative media to do it. But it doesn't matter because what came first, the chicken or the egg? I don't even want the credit. I'm giving you a testament to how our information has become mainline. And how we're going to continue to gain traction. We are the real media. The Western Journalism Center, Joseph Farah, is listed in here. And others that then basically help set the stage for things like drudge to come along. This happened three years before Drudge hit the scene. And again, that just shows how important people like Joseph Farah are. I want to get Joseph Farah on about this. I mean, imagine the Clintons 24-7 were fearing him. Because he'd come out of the biggest newspapers in the country as a major editor and was going out to create the first independent journalism. Until 88, folks... There wasn't talk radio. It wasn't allowed in this so-called free country until the lawyer we've had on, Bruce Fine, got it changed at the FCC. He was the deputy head of it. See how you can change the world? We exist because of Bruce Fine. Drudge exists because of people like Farah. And now Drudge helps everybody else. We're all on the same team for an open, free press. We are the you liberals. Are to they are the authoritarians. Visit GCN. They are authoritarian scum. We'll be right back. Alex Jones here to tell you about how you can help spread liberty worldwide while also enjoying what I have found to be the best tasting 100% organic coffee on the planet. For more than a decade, my favorite coffee has come from the high mountains of southern Mexico where the Chiapas farmers grow their unique shade-grown Arabica beans. We have now managed to secure these sought-after beans in a highly customized blend. Discover and try a bag of the Patriot Blend 100% organic coffee at InfoWarsLife.com. This coffee gives 
gives you a long, smooth pick-me-up for hours without the headaches and heartburn that so many other coffees give me personally. Hands down, this is my favorite coffee. And it's taken us years to secure connections directly to the Chiapas Mexican farmers. Drop by the site today, order a bag or two, and I don't think you're going to be disappointed. Available in original or with our immune support infusion blend. You will be supporting a free press, all the while enjoying a truly great tasting cup of my favorite coffee. Available at InfoWarsLife.com. Coast to coast, direct from Austin.